probably the easiest method. Grab a speed square, set your speed square up against the table edge. You can use that to get yourself squared. The speed square allows you to move anywhere on the table and still maintain squareness. You can also use your quads dogs. Push your guide rail tight up against them. You can tighten it down. Your guide rail is now aligned to the holes and to the side of the table. If you had a fence, the Fez tool fence, you could now align your fence by using the speed square. One thing you might notice with the Quasi dogs, your cutting edge is now lined up right over the top of a series of holes. This could lead to some tear out on the bottom of your board. To get around that, you can use a spacer. I use an aluminum extrusion, which I know is parallel and squared, and by using that, I'm no longer lined up against the holes. You could use a piece of wood, you can use a scrap piece of wood, But a scrap you might have to check a couple times, but when it's finally there you can lock your tape, lock your guide down. To cut your board, We will swing the guide rail up, move your quads dogs to some appropriate holes. I'm going to use one right underneath the guide rail so I get maximum support right up to the cutting edge. Put your board in place, bring your guide rail down. Lock the height of your guide rail. Put your saw up in position. Make sure you got it squarely locked in. Hold your board with your hand firmly up against your, your quads dogs and then make your cut. Nice square cut. I can test it with a machinist square.
Don't know how good you can see that, but it's dead on.